Light, see you on the other side. 10 seconds to LOS. O5G Light is on, re entry is starting. Okay, LOS in 3, 2, 1. Okay, guys, there's LOS with Houston, we're on our own. You would definitely not want to be out there right now. very nice. We are down below two minutes to expected AOS. One minute to expected AOS. I don't know what's going on with these water droplets. Right, so better hope this doesn't short circuit us. Thirty seconds to AOS. I don't know what the hell this is. Okay, there's five minutes. We should have AOS with Houston. Spec Max G at EI plus seven minutes. Maybe we don't have AOS yet. I don't hear anything. And this is copy. Apollo 10. This is Houston. I hear something. Sounds very choppy. Apollo 10, this is Houston. I 
Uh, sorry, Houston, this is Apollo 10. Say again. Apollo 10, this is Houston. How copy? Alright, we copy you 5x5. Five five. It's uh, raining in the cabin up here. It's uh, what now? You got water droplets coming off the main instrument panel here. That's a new one. Uh, I think we are. Uh, do you think we'll short circuit? How severe is it? It's pretty bad. Getting my visor all wet. If well, we short circuit, the pyros on the parachutes might not deploy. It's coming from the instrument panel towards you, correct? Yeah, it's water condensation on the panel. Stand by. Look, if we short circuit, the whole thing could go. If the pyros fail, we'll smack into the earth. Yeah, we're aware of that. Stand by. Through max G now, approaching 7 Gs and dropping. It's not that bad. Definitely seen worse. I think it's that much water, Ed, but uh, it's it's definitely water. You should be fine, Ted, as long as it's not leaking out of the instrument panels. It is leaking out of the instrument panels. Uh, stand by. You got one minute to drogue deploy. Let's hope that drogue parachute comes out. Well, if it's coming down at you, it's not too big of a problem. Because behind you is just storage, but if it's coming down from the... In Hold on, stand by. Do you have, like, an exact location that it's coming out of? Ken? Okay, where on the panel? Is it, like, a crack, a knob, or is it, like, coming down from somewhere else? Drogues are out, Houston. Roger that, we got drogues, shoot the point. Standing by on the mains. And uh, Booster reports drogues looks good, and he also reports that it should be no problem. Main deploy. Uh, that's an A-firm, Houston. We have main shoot deploy. There you go. Well, that's a bit of a relief. But why in the hell is it raining? <laughs> or it's not anymore, but it was. My, uh, my guess is condensation.
Uh, notify when you have splashdown, 10. Roger. Uh, according to the reference timeline, we should expect about EI plus 15 for splashdown. We're at about EI plus 13 right now, so two minutes to expected splashdown. The recover, uh, recovery helo got you inside. Ten. Yeah, okay. Hey, at least we're in stable one. Okay, uh, Houston, we have splashdown. We're in stable one. We'll contact the recovery crews. Roger that. And uh, thank you for all the help over the past few days. It's nice to be back. Yeah, Tom, John, Ed, welcome home. Yeah, you heard him, John and Ed. Okay, uh, let's... Uh, and you contact the recovery, you get in contact with the recovery crews, Tom, you and I should work on uh, post-landing. And, uh, use some mission control here, we're gonna be signing off. After that mission control, we copy that you're signing off. We're going to start on post landing now. And Ed, I had said you should get in contact with the recovery crews while me and Tom work on post landing procedure. Houston out.